Franco Cavallari coming to you from Biologic to talk about intermittent fasting in the context of insulin resistance. And the interesting thing we see, the research shows, in fact, that those who have insulin resistance, which is the desensitization of insulin signaling, and that then results in compromised or impaired blood sugar clearance from the blood into the tissues. And that, therefore, fasting blood sugar is high and then other things tend to happen. There's a cascade of health issues that occur from that state of insulin resistance, which is pre-diabetic. And in fact, if that insulin resistance, as I explained earlier, progresses extensively, then you can be diagnosed with type 2 diabetes. Type 2 diabetes is ultimately an advanced stage of insulin resistance. Now, what we're seeing is that people who tend to respond well and do well on intermittent fasting are those who have various states of insulin resistance and or type 2 diabetes. Those who just don't function as well and say, hey, I function better uh, outside the scope of an intermittent fasted state or intermittent fasting program. And the fact is then that usually means that their insulin function is quite effective and the brain is getting enough energy substrate, glucose, from the diet and from the body. There are various types of type 2 diabetes, in fact, or various ranges, and in fact, a type 3 diabetes associated with the brain. And that's where people tend to develop cognitive problems and or deficits and recall. Dementia often is associated with type 3 diabetes. And the fasting then allows the body to make ketones so that the brain can use ketones for energy independent of insulin signaling. Ketone doesn't require insulin signaling to be taken into the neuron, and the neuron can make ATP and energy from the ketone, le ketone like it can glucose. But in fact, it's said, and the research shows, more efficiently with the ketone than with glucose can it make an ATP molecule for energizing the cell. This is why some people light up, wow, I, I feel great when I'm fasted. Those who don't feel that great or not better than they would when they're eating small meals frequently throughout the day are usually those who don't have various states of insulin resistance. It's that simple.